Welcome to Coco's Corner. I'm the huge one, Dave Coco, from CocoSports.com, K-O-C-O Sports.com, where it's okay to be a passionate fan, where the world goes to get gas, and your home for combat sports. Now, this show is dedicated to a YouTuber, Mr. Hall. Uh, he started doing his own YouTube, but he's a huge Japan fan, and he kind of called me a punk-ass bitch, and I understand. I absolutely love pro -res. Um, Japanese pro wrestling, but I mostly just talk about American pro wrestling because I'm a fucking whore that, w <laughs> that wants the shows to be watched. Um, I want to cover more Japan wrestling. I'll do my fave five in the future, and I'll try to hit all the major stories, and then I'll do reviews. But the problem with Japan is they want a lot more shows and a lot more companies. So first thing I'll do is a fave five of my favorite companies in a future video, and... I'll also ask you, what type of Japan shows do you want? I do live in Tokyo, Japan. My wife is a translator, and I love Japanese pro wrestling the best. Now, if we did my fave five a couple years ago, maybe 10, I won't, 10, 20 years ago, all Japan used to be the fucking bomb. All Japan used to be the best pro wrestling company in the world. Then something happens. They are a laughing stock of what they've been. If we were did my Fave 5 a couple years ago, All Japan would have been number one. I'm going to give you a spoiler for a future video of my Fave 5 Japanese companies. All Japan doesn't even make the list. All Japan does not make the list. Um, it, it's just a sad situation. But they had a press conference earlier this week, depending on where you live. <laughs> Let's just keep it safe. They had a press conference to held to officially announce um, All Japan's rebrand into All Japan Pro Wrestling and I'm going to mispronounce this word, katakana. Katakana is a different way. In Japan, there's different ways to write stuff. They have a bunch of different ways. Um, I'm absolutely horrible at all of them. <laughs> Maybe one thing I'm afraid of doing pro rest shows is because my pro I'm not very good at speaking Japanese, and I've lived here a long time, and I'm not good at pronouncing stuff, and I think someone's going to call me out on it. Even though in English, I mispronounce words all the time, and no one gives a fuck. But if I mispronounce a word in Japanese, they'll be like, I fucking hate you! I studied Japanese for 12 fucking years, and I don't live in Japan! I hate... Whoa, 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 whoa. Pump your brakes, Japan lover. Um, you can move here. No one's stopping you. Uh, anyway, um, yeah, I plan on doing more Japan shows, but Hawk called me out, and I had to do it, and this was a huge press conference. All right, they're renaming it. They're also getting rid of the fucking idiot who ran it before, and they're going to try to rebuild it. At one time, New Japan, which is the best wrestling company in the world right now, is it my favorite? Stay tuned for a fake five. Um, rebuild it, and they got it. So they did get it. They mentioned, you know, how the previous owner of All Japan, who still owns all the trademarks, that's why they had to rename it. They still worked something out. Um, basically, was fucking crazy. The guy was crazy. That's why Muda left. The guy's like, this guy's fucking nuts. He would go around saying, we'll fight New Japan. And, and, and well, one of the craziest things he said was. <laughs> He said that he could be his roster could beat New Japan's roster, and New Japan has like legit fighters. And Muda's like, uh, "Are you fucking crazy?" Um, he did promise the Great Muda um, that he would run stuff, and lied to Great Muda, and that's how World One or W One Wrestling was made. So, but the one thing that scares me is the new All Japan. That's that rolls off the tongue. The new All Japan will work no differently from All Japan of the past forty plus years. That scares me because stop running like the last five years. Um, Aki Bono, uh, he's a Yokozuna turned pro wrestler. Um, in my humble opinion, Aki Bono put Sumo on the world's map for foreigners. People absolutely loved, I don't know about people, but there are there are foreigners now that love Sumo that didn't love it before Aki Bono. Aki Bono is huge, and he was a free agent, just cashing those free agent checks. Cha-ching, cha-ching, cha-ching. Oh, zero one. here I am, your champ. Cha-ching. New Japan, here I am. All Japan, here I am. Cha -ching, cha -ching, cha -ching. And then he signed an exclusive contract. And I remember everyone was excited. Like, oh, my God. It was kind of like, for a short time, it was kind of like, where were LeBron going to sign for Japan wrestling fans? And the funny thing is, it even got mainstream media. I was like, where the fuck is Aki Bono going to sign? And I kid you not, when they said All Japan, everyone I knew just felt bad. For like, ah, well, I hope he's getting paid a lot. Aki Bono's going to All Japan. Good luck. So hopefully they turn it around. They do plan on protecting all Japan. They do plan on rebuilding it, and it needs rebuilding. Um, it, when it comes to companies, a lot of people bash TNA and how it's ran. Dixie Carter looks like a genius compared to how all Japan has been run the last couple of years. So hopefully they, they redo it. Um, they do, and 
this they get a lot in this press release. It's on CocoSports.com. I'll put it down in the link. Um, the company's capital is 10 million yen, so minus a zero, it's one million dollars. Uh, that is fuzzy. I'm a stupid gaijin math. Um, they have they have Bobo still on the board of directors, and they have the list of people, and their official roster is not that long. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. 13 people, all Japan. One time, the WWE of Japan. One time, one of the biggest companies in the world has 13 people under roster. They would have a lot more if they fucking didn't fuck Muda. So it's weird. And Wrestle 1 just recently drew 750 people where TNA is going to have their pay per view. So I'm really worried. Um, you still have Akibono. Obviously, you're not going to get five star matches out of him, but. You, you, like, you got Go. Go is really popular. And I'm trying to look. You know, a lot of these guys are not that good. Sushi. Sushi is so over with the kids, though. My son loves sushi. He's basically Curry Man, except he's got sushi on his head. Of course. Why not? So, um, yeah, 13 people under contract. Um, they, in Japan, there is a lot of free agents. And if you're popular like an Akibono or something like that, or a Tanaka, even a Muda at times... You can make a lot of money being a free agent, but I don't know. I, I I hope all Japan can turn it around, but I'm looking at this roster. They're still not in my Fave Five. They're not, you know. I, I say I always joke that Wrestle One is a fifth tier company in Japan, and I mean that because a lot of people in America don't realize that Buddha's Wrestle One isn't that big of a deal here. But uh, <laughs> Wrestle One is even bigger than all Japan. Um, All Japan and lost their television contract on free television, um, and yeah, so hopefully All Japan can turn around. I'll be rooting for them, but this is the best piece of news I've had in a while. I can just see All Japan being turned around. So there you go. I wanted to keep this a little bit short. Um, we'll we'll be doing more and more Japan shows. I wanted to know like what company you want to go for, what type of you want me to hit the major news? Because I plan on adding a lot more shows. And I live in Japan, and I love Japan wrestling. My biggest fear is maybe there's not interest out there on YouTube for reviews. Um, uh, second biggest fear is I'm not good at pronouncing Japanese words. I live in Japan, so it's kind of fucking embarrassing. And the third thing is a lot of the reviews are going to be, Dragon Gate was fucking awesome. How are you not watching this? New Japan was fucking awesome. How are you not watching this? And I don't know if people want to see those reviews. So... Um, yeah, so I will be doing a Fade 5, and I will be doing more shows, but, you know, Mr. Hall's been calling me out for a while, and you know what, this show, even if it gets no views, I hope Mr. Hall at least watches, <laughs> this show is dedicated to Mr. Hall. Um, let me go find out his full name, I apologize, so you guys can go check out his, um, channel. These technical difficulties of me being unprepared are brought to you by CocoSports.com. I know he's doing a bunch of videos now, and he loves Japan Wrestling. Um, Shundell Hall. Um, go check him out. He started making videos recently um, with titles of John Cena's the best ever. Fuck the haters. All right. Um, fuck all you WWE fans. And what and who killed the wrestling industry? ROH wrestling fucking sucks. All right. Well, um, I see you like Japan wrestling. I don't. So yeah. So go check out Shundell Hall. S H O N D L L H A L L on YouTube. Um, obviously got some controversial stuff that I don't agree with, but hey, that's what YouTube's about. But he called out my pawn card. He's like, oh, bitch, you've been talking about fucking Japan wrestling, how great it is to talk about it. So here you go. So in the comments below, can all Japan be saved? What type of Japanese wrestling videos do you want me to do? I'm not going to do illegal content. It's, you can find it on Daily Motion. We can put it on CocoSports.com, but I'm not going to put it up on YouTube. I'm sorry, I'm not going to do that. And um, and I'm not I'm not against pirating. I just I just that's not what this channel's about. I'm sorry. All right. So yeah. So can all Japan be saved? What type of Japanese pro wrestling, if any, videos do you want me to do? And go to kukosports.com, K-O-C-O sports.com, where the world comes to kick ass. And with that, I am over. <laughs> Bum, 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 bum,